Thanks to Seven Steps to Wealth brings us some Division 2 game face coverage. And Rye, I'm joined by uh, Matt McIndoe, who's played his time of game for the Rye Footy Club, mate. A close win against Seven Meadows. Pretty happy with that. Yeah, very happy. The um, boys dug deep. They are, uh, you know, all down pretty much most of that fourth quarter and then yeah they um <coughs> yeah started winning the clearances and got it forward and yeah we had a pretty strong we, we, win. We didn't see too much of the game, we could only see it on the game face record app, yeah. but we could see it was a seesawing contest as we've got someone trying to put us off 100 oh, percent behind yeah. the camera and it's putting me off you <laughs> um, <laughs> obviously a seesawing contest. What were you thinking in the third quarter when Devin got their nose in front? Um, just that we gotta you know just do everything to win, you know we've got to take the risk, switch every opportunity and Try and you know win the clearances. It was a pretty terrible day, as you can see. The weather was pretty shocking. But in these conditions, these are the games you really want to win, aren't they? Like yeah. going into a game today, knowing the weather's going to be crap, um, and, and knowing Devon Meadows aren't aren't a, a terrible side at all. No. Um, you guys are starting to put together some games. Obviously, you, you, you pushed Kringle. Yeah. So you knew going into this game, you had a fair bit of form. Yeah, yeah. We we seem to um, match it with most sides, but we just can't string that four quarters. And I think today we really stood up when we needed to. And yeah, Devon the same. They can match it with any side. And just, yeah, they just sort of dropped off in that last quarter, which was good for us. Well, enjoy the win. You guys seem up and about to uh, have a good yeah. night tonight. It's yeah. your 200 tonight as well, mate. Yeah. Congratulations, 200 games. Thanks, Thanks for, for that. joining me for a chat. That's all right. Thanks. I'm now joined by the right coach, who's also the league best in Ferris of 2018. He's carrying some injuries at the moment, but uh, you'll carry an injury for a win like today, mate. Oh, absolutely. So, you know, today, really hard fought win against Devon. They've probably been in a real similar boat to us over the last month, where you know, probably feel like they should have should have got a win and you know, we're in that same boat so we're really, really happy to you know, walk away with the four points today. It was neck and neck all game. Uh, I don't think anybody got a clear break of three goals. No. Um, you guys have spoken about to us in the past that you haven't been able to put four quarters together as much as you probably want to. Yeah. You saw Devin get in front of the third quarter. What was yeah. going through your mind saying, are we going to drop another one here in the second half? Yeah, look, it always goes through the back of your mind, but I had a lot of confidence in the boys. Have we Today, really... We needed a win like that. We needed a win where our backs were against the wall. You know, the scoring end was you know the end we weren't going to in the last four, so it was really good to be able to you know fight against it, you know, break the tide and you know get a really good win. What do you think of Devon today? They got a fair, fair few injuries, they're they're going pretty hard as well. Oh look I, as I said, I actually sort of see a lot of similarities between us and Devon over the last month where again they put themselves in winning positions most weeks and they've just been unable to go on with it and you know somebody was gonna get the win today and you know, I was glad it was us. You must have felt that your patches of footy were coming towards a win. Yeah. All right, and that's it. Like, I think we've played you know, some really good quarters of footy, some really good halves of footy, but just without really stringing it together for you know, that extended period of time. So our focus today was a real four-quarter effort. Yeah, good. Matt McIndoe, 200 games. Uh, what did it mean to get a win for him today, mate? Oh, hey, you know, Matty's one of the boys. who's He's been here forever and a day, and... You know, he just bleeds red and blue, he's on the committee, he's always around, he's got his family here, he's pretty much grown up around the club, so it meant a lot to get the win for him and you know, couldn't have done it in a better way. Very good mate, well congratulations on a, a, clo a close tight win against uh, Devon Meadows, a gutsy one. Yeah. The boys are rowdy and excited for a big night for yeah. McIndoe's 200th mate. Go and enjoy it, thanks cool. for joining us. No worries, thanks mate. Get your game face on.